in the midst of your contemporaries, God will single you out for favor and I command his blessing upon your life today in the name of Jesus. I command the blessings of God into your storehouses. Your God will bless the work of your hands. Whatever job and business you are doing at the moment, I speak life into it because God is commanding. God is commanding blessing right now. The weight of the Gentile is coming back to you. God is changing the spiritual manipulations. You have suffered too much. People have pressed you down too much. You have put your market and nobody is responding. The table is about to turn to your favor. Right now, God is commanding blessing into the work of your hands. You shall be blessed going out. You shall be blessed coming in. The blessing is not just going out, but in your house, there is a blessing in your house. In the name of Jesus, I decree and I declare God's blessing into your storehouse, into the works of your hands, and into the land that you occupy. I decree and I declare that the great land that you occupy will begin to yield harvest for you. The nation where you are begin to yield harvest for you. Harvest upon harvest, in the name of Jesus, I command the blessings of the Lord into your life in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Whatever you put your hands shall be blessed. No man can curse you in the name of Jesus Christ. Every people that go into witchcraft, coven, and wherever they go to organize prayer against your destiny, no weapon fashion against you prosper in the name of Jesus Christ like the Causes of Balaam cannot stand. He could not be able to operate and perform his expenditure in your life. Therefore, no cause shall alert in your life. I calculate every cause out of your destiny, out of your job, out of your life in the name of Jesus. From this moment onward, you come under the commanded blessing. This is the place where God is commanding your blessing. I command a commanded blessing upon your life. Even as you are worshiping me, you are under the powers of commanded blessing. Your head will carry blessing. You are going out and you are coming in with carry blessing. You are a carrier of divine blessing. From this moment onward, no cause will be attached to you or identify with you and speak blessing upon your life in the name that is above every other name. Whatever it is that the enemy is using to manipulate your destiny and to want to make you to be slave from this moment the table is turned in the name of Jesus as God turned the table for Job. God is turning the table on your favor in the name that is above every other name. There is a changing oh God the, the weight of the Gentile is being transferred. There is an exchange in the realms of the spirit as you come under this commanded blessing. I speak blessing. I speak favor. I speak promotion. I speak a new job. I speak a new job opportunity. New business venture. New innovation. New invention. In the name of Jesus, I release you under the power of commanded blessing. Wherever you go, there is a commanded blessing. Wherever you touch, is commanding blessing. Wherever you go, He's commanding blessing. Your word is commanding blessing. Your business is commanding blessing. Your life, your body, your tissue, the blood in your body from the crown of your head is commanding blessing. I bind you to the healing power of the blood of Jesus Christ. I bind your head, your legs, your mind, your head, your body, any sickness in your body, I command it. Come out in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I bind you to the forces of greatness. You, I bind you to the forces of greatness, I bind you to prosperity, I bind you to increase, I bind you to promotion, I bind you to stupendous weight. You will enter into your inheritance, you will leap over walls and over barriers, every hindrance, they are giving way for you to this moment because you are under the commanded blessings of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, I see you going forward, I see you going up, this is your moment, this is your time as you come under the ministry of commanded blessing, born to conquer I see you conquering. I see you conquering. No more defeat in your life. No more backward in your life. No more ups and downs in your life. It's because you have come under De Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse 8. God is blessing the work of your hands. God is releasing blessing to your storehouses. 
God is blessing you in the nation where you occupy, wherever you are. You are single out for favor and you are single out for commanded blessing. It will rest upon your head. Lord God, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I bind that ministry under the apostolic power, under the apostolic anointing. From this moment, that church begins to grow. I speak to you, minister. You have suffered too long enough. This is your moment of manifestation. I bind you to apostolic anointing. In your church, there shall be movement. There shall be a new atmosphere for miracle and for power in the name of Jesus. I bind you to the forces of greatness. Your name and your ministry will be known around the world in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ because you are under commanded blessing. God is blessing your storehouse and your feed. He's blessing you in your ministry from this moment. The anointing has come to say because God is the one commanding. He's commanding it and the whole forces of heaven is responding to that. Creation is supporting your just cause from this moment onward because you are under a commanded blessing.